we are back heading to Death Valley. Uh, this time we're heading in on a Friday evening, but I thought maybe if we came in on a Friday, we'd have a better chance at least getting a spot for tonight. And then tomorrow night, um, we can do something on some uh, dispersed land or um, in the backcountry. Anyway, as you can see, it's starting to get dark and hopefully get a campsite. If we can't find one, uh, we'll probably just drive around until uh, we can find a, uh, an off-road trail. And I guess we'll just um, camp uh, back in some backcountry area uh, for the night. Uh, all right, I'm losing, I'm losing light here. We'll check in uh, in the morning. turn into a sandstorm huge like 40 mile per hour wind gusts sand is going everywhere so we drove all the way down to um, the campsite and people were scrambling to get their tents anchored um, we would have ended up having sand in the tent and the truck so we came all the way back up the mountain halfway to where we started halfway to Beatty pulled off on an off-road trail um, and but it is windier than shit up here too all right well you said we we came in to the valley and I saw this almost looked like fog so thick but it was a, a sandstorm basically well what, the winds were coming um coming from the south going north wrapping around this mountain range they're coming down in the valley picking up all this sand with it and so you could see sand was shooting up hundreds and hundreds of feet in the air Well, 8 30 8 40 we're already down in the valley we're headed to the racetrack which is what we missed last time really excited to see this nothing like this. This is very unique. Absolutely crazy.
And my little co-pilot, what do you say? Dad, it's so warm. A day man going to the racetrack and then leaving racetrack going south through the mountain pass and that is a commitment we sat out from the north side of the park at like 8 a.m. and it's 4 p.m. and we're just now back around about 45 minutes from where we started. Um, if you've got the uh, adequate vehicle, I recommend doing it, but it takes a day, it's a full day trip. I just, I read, I didn't realize that Death Valley is three, like 3.5 million acres of you know, protected land. And I thought Gila National Forest in New, New Mexico is big at 2 million acres. Well, we're finally set up before sundown. We pulled out the awning just for fun. Owen's ready to go. Buddy, what are you doing? What are you doing? Dad, I'm hot. I'm ready to go to bed. It's been a long day. Well, things were going great, and then all of a sudden, We've got 20, 30, 40 mile per hour wind gusts coming over the mountains. And it about took the awning completely off. I couldn't get packed in right at the point. But so we were, we're in a channel from the mountainside that goes down in Dead Valley and the winds were I bet they were 40 mile per hour plus so we had to lash down well we're all packed up that was a hell of a night what a night what a night what a night man it was crazy